everyone, Mango Sentinel here. How are we doing today? It, it's a good day. We finished the sub one minute achievement. I am so happy, so excited to finally get it done. Finally, in quotes, as if that took a long time. Uh, super fun. This is the first experience, the first real super challenge in this game. And I'm really happy it was in here. Uh, a lot of people complained because um, they thought it was only for whales, only for people who spent too much money. And um, they were kind of pissed at that, so I'm really glad we got this done with a bunch of people who have spent money. I think everybody here has spent money, but obviously nowhere near whale proportions. Um, obviously, you can see my account that's super, super, super lucky, but you also have to remember we have seven days left or so, and um, I could definitely get my team strong enough to do this. I even don't have people like Celery fully built up who would be better in this situation. That's kind of something to think about. Um, so I just want to give a bunch of shout outs first before I show you the actual clip here and talk a little bit more about it. Um, we have T. Grassy here. His team is in the top right. Thank you so much for that. Uh, super appreciate you being around here. Fantastic streamer as well. Uh, feel free to check him out. You absolutely should. We have Mazjack in the top left here with the fantastic Lily, of course. Also a fantastic streamer. Great person as well. And uh, you can check him out on Twitch too. Uh, and then on the bottom, we have UV without a Twitch channel because I don't know. I don't know why. I'm also pretty jealous of that Julieta. I really do want that Julieta. This is uh, all the teams we used here. Uh, thank you so much for that. We also have huge support from Vigirai. Um, helped me out a lot, especially me, I think, because he got to watch me do this and screw up over and over and over again. Uh, I had a lot of problems with targeting it in this time, and I think I learned a lot about the game because of how I had to continually fix my targeting. So really, really, really cool on that. Uh, as for um, my team here, I ended up with this. Yes, I start with Maribel. I'm the Maribel slave in this battle here. I'm the one who uh, runs in, gets defense break on everything. That's what we use Maribel for. And then I switch to Lily and just start going bananas on the boss. Um, everybody else just goes bananas from the start. I then use Lily, of course. She's at her final mana circle, um, but she doesn't have everything unlocked. Then I have Zanefried here, and then I have Ezeleth. I just didn't know who to put in outside of Ezeleth, but my entire goal was just to get as many team buffs as physically possible. I actually had Hawk in for a while instead of Ez because I did like Hawk's uh, buff better, but I don't think that was working too well. Um, so yeah, this is the team here. As for my weapons, I have a 4-star on... Very Bell, I have a 5-star tier 2 on um, Lily, and I think I'm the only person with 5-star weapons here. Most others are 4-star. I have a 5-star on Zanefried as well, and I do have a 5-star on Ezeleth. And I actually made those two just for this fight, because why not? Uh, and you can see here, we even have in the top right there, our main DPS uh, Celery there was a 4-star. So just to give you an idea of 4-star units and how they're usable, there is absolutely... Um, leeway for for this clear uh as for strategy i will really talk about that i think tomorrow i want to do a whole video on that and this is just to show the clear uh so yeah thank you all so much and enjoy this clear and hopefully you guys can get it too if you ever have any questions come ask us in twitch all of us are there usually um in one of our channels so uh enjoy and have a wonderful day guys bye now um. I had really bad targeting there. Oh my god, that was a juicy Leviathan hit. That was the best Leviathan hit you've ever seen in your life. DPS. Hype! Hype! 